Today I'm going to show you how to set up a small frog tank. This is how I do my standard 10 gallon for my froglets and my tadpoles that are about to morph out. So first thing you need is a standard 10 gallon glass aquarium. Um, I find that acrylic tends to scratch really bad, it fogs up, it tends to weep on the outside if there's any sort of temperature change. Acrylic's just not a good idea, at least for me, I haven't filmed. Um, first thing you need after your tank, this is called LECA, Lightweight Expanded Clay Aggregate. It's actually pretty light, they're just little kind of almost rock-like balls that are poofed out. It adds a lot of surface area and you use it to make what's called a false bottom. By putting this in, what you're doing is just making a spot that if any water falls down, it falls down into this. Plants can put their roots down into it. You're kind of setting up a little drainage system so you're not getting a waterlogged tank. inch, maybe two, I wouldn't go any more than that. Some people use egg crate and they put it on little stilts so you have just empty space at the bottom for water. I don't like that because this actually gives surface area for good bacteria to cover. Um, I've used foam in the past, also don't really like that. It's hard to cut, it's expensive, roots can't get it into as well, it doesn't drain as well. I just prefer LECA. Next, you need your landscape fabric. This is just standard weed block fabric. Um, water can get through this. It's not water repellent. You want it to be able to drain. You're just creating a barrier between your soil and your LECA so you don't get a bunch of dirt washing into your bottom layer. You want to cut that a little bit bigger than your tank. 